your question is solve they have given you 4x plus 3 3x minus 1 less than 2x x plus 3 so you can see this is your inequality sign so first what we have to do we have to solve lhs and this side rhs and bring after that bring everything to your left side we will do the same thing here 4x 3x is 12x square minus 4x into 1 is 4x plus 3 into 3 is 9x minus 3 and towards your right what is that 2x square plus 6x now bring this to your left side you will get what 12x square and here is minus 4x plus 9x is 5x. So you will get 5x minus 3. This is 2x square at right side. It will become a minus 2x square. This is 6x. It will become a minus 6x less than 0. Now solve this. So here you will get 12x square minus 2x square is 10x square. 5x minus 6x is minus x and here comes minus 3 it should be less than 0 now solve this by taking 0 that is equal to 0 so can we go for uh, minute term splitting you can see 10 into 3 is 30 and we should make x so 30 means 5 into 6 and 6 minus 5 is 1. Yes, we can go for that. So here you will get what? 10 x square minus 6x plus 5x minus 3 that is equal to 0 now. We have to take that is equal to 0. After that answer when we are solving, at that time we will write everything. You can see 2x is common. Here you will get 5x minus 3. Here 1 is common. Again you will get 5x minus 3. That is equal to 0. Now the two factors are what? 2x plus 1. And second is 5x minus 3. That is equal to 0. It shows that here x is equal to minus 1 by 2. And here x is equal to 3 by 5. Now see the equation. Where is the equation? You can see the equation is here. And the coefficient of x square is positive. Therefore we will get a minimum point. So your parabola should come like this. Now. Minus 1 by 2 lies left to the 3 by 4. So here we will write minus 1 by 2. And here we will write 3 by 5. Now see the inequality sign. What is that? You can see less than. That means we have to move towards the negative. So negative lies here. This way. Now your answer is what? You can see minus 1 by 2 if you move towards this side that means it should be greater than that. So x is what? Should be greater than minus 1 by 2 and if you move towards left of 3 by 5 you can see the value is decreasing. So you can see what? x should be less than 3 by 5. Now make the relationship x should be here greater than and less than. You can see where x should be greater than minus 1 by 2. And here comes x should be less than 3 by 5. So this is your relation. Now 